Hello there everyone, it's a boy Ranarok from Malaysia and in this video I'll be showing you guys how to fix the problem that most Windows 11 users have when they try to start up Valorant and that is an error saying that you need to enable TPM 2.0 and also the secure boot. Now this video is mostly for the people that use the BioStar A320MH motherboard for their PC because this video is going to be like all the other YouTube are all the other videos that a lot of people already upload on YouTube, you need to go to your BIOS and enable TPM 2.0 and also secure boot, blah blah blah, and that is all. But for for me, um, that I use the BIOSTAR A320MH motherboard, and after I enable all of that, I still have the problem because you know, for some reason, th this motherboard, the BIOS, is kind of different the way how you enable the secure boot, you need to do some more steps after that. So yeah, so without further ado, I don't want to talk too much, let's just go straight to the video. Um, first, what you need to do is to check if your TPM is 2.0 and if it is enabled. So you can press the Windows key and also the R key at the same time to open up run. But you can also go to your Windows search and type in run and open it up just like that. Now you need to type in tpm.msc and click OK. And here we go, as you can see the status, the TPM is ready for use, so my TPM is already enabled and specific specification version is 2.0. I don't think Windows 11 is available if you don't have a TPM 2.0, so yeah. But as you can see the status, it is enabled, so if it, is, if, if it says it is disabled, I'm also going to show you guys how to enable, enable it later after we go to our BIOS. So after you check that, let's just close it up and let's restart our PC to go to our BIOS or you can also shut it down and open it up. It's up to you, so yeah, I'm just gonna restart it. So let's go to our BIOS. So now we're in the BIOS settings. So what you need to do, I, I'm gonna use the arrow key because the mouse cursor is very laggy when I'm in the BIOS for some reason. So use the arrow key and go to advanced and go to trusted computing, the first one. And make sure you enable the security device support. Enable it and just copy everything that it shows right here. Uh, and as you can see, TPM 2.0 UEFI spec version. Make sure you choose TCG underscore 2. And yeah, just copy everything that I show you guys right here. So now let's go with escape and go to security and go to secure boot right here and enable secure boot and after that what you need to do is go to key management and enter restore factory keys and click yes so now after you turn on secure boot uh, if you go to if you go to advanced and go to csm configuration everything here is disabled but yours probably not because you haven't turned on the secure boot but if it still shows something at here make sure you change everything to uefi only because some of them might be in legacy and we don't want legacy so change everything to uefi and that's all so now we can go to save and exit and save changes and reset and yes so now let's just check it again if your TPM is enabled and ready for use. So let's go to our run and type in tpm.msc, click OK and yours probably will say the TPM is ready for use in the status. So yeah, after that what you need to do is just let's open Valorant. So now as you can see, your Valorant will run smoothly, There's, there won't show any error anymore. And let's try and go to practice just to load the game and see if it's still going to show the error and you can see it won't show you any error anymore so oh yeah that is all for this video i hope this video helped you guys if it does then please leave a like and also a comment and if you guys want more videos on my channel then please click subscribe and I'm truly sorry if after you follow all my steps and you still have the problem I'm sorry I can't really help you so and I'm also not a professional I'm just poking around in my bios and suddenly I found the solution so if, it, if this video still doesn't help you then I am truly sorry but if it does then please leave a like and yeah I guess I'll see you guys later bye guys